what's up everybody jess here at old jam farms today i want to show you a product i've been using it really helps me get oil in the back of the tractor and it, it'll be great for other equipment as well it really makes this uh, job effortless and painless let me show you what it is all right like i said i'm adding some hydraulic oil to the back of the tractor uh, it's a little bit low and i'll just cut right to the chase you can see this hose running down through here now i usually buy these by the five gallon bucket just because you actually probably get a little bit cheaper than if you're just buying a gallon at a time. But what we got here is a, they call it a drum pump. Uh, this one's made specifically for five gallon buckets. And this is a Spico brand, I believe. I'll look on Amazon for these if I can find them. I will post the description uh, below. So you can check that out for yourself. Like I said, it's, I've been doing it forever, you know, or I did forever with the, uh, just sticking a funnel in there. Having to hold the bucket up, praying that you don't spill it all over the ground and everywhere else. And man, this is the way to go right here. Let me see if I can get this prime. This is a brand new bucket. I just put this in here. So we'll see. See how long it takes to prime. I just did one pump and it's already going up in there. So you can see that right there. There is a ball valve in the bottom that acts as a, uh, like a, just to keep it from going back down in the bucket. So now I'm pumping it. I got that stuck down in my hole right there. And we're pumping oil just that easy. So I'm gonna do a few pumps here and then I'm gonna check it. And uh, check my level and make sure we're good. But I just wanna show you that real quick. Uh, if you ain't familiar with these, they make some that are actually battery powered. And those work great. Uh, I don't, I don't want to go that route because I don't want to mess with having to keep a battery charged uh, and then worrying about if it's charged every time I go to want to put oil in the tractor. So just for the sake of this, something that's real quick, uh, it's actually really handy when you're doing your oil changes, uh, fluid changes, and you can pump that stuff in there real quick. And it's really handy for just topping these off and keeping them topped off because no matter how much you try, these older tractors, I mean, they start to leak around these connectors here. You might can see where some of it's been leaking, dripping down. Now it's collected dirt and things. And I've got to come in and replace, I think, some seals in my connectors right here because it does drip a little bit at a time. I just, I just watch it. it doesn't, it's not a major leak. No big deal. But just something to watch. So another cool feature about this one here is uh, actually give you a storage place for your nozzle. And this little hole right here actually connects to the tube that's down in here or to this it's basically open this little hole right here is open down into this bucket so if you do have some residual drain out it'll actually just drain back down your bucket and uh, keep from making a mess everywhere it's so already like that feature so yeah like i said a uh, really handy little device that it's one of those things where you know if you never have it uh no big deal but once you have one and you use it you realize just how handy it is and like i said this is a spico brand so i'll, I'll try to put a link uh down in the description for it and uh yeah i went in this video here i uh, just wanted to show that to you that's something i've i found to be really handy and uh just want to say thanks for watching if you found this video helpful give it a thumbs up uh, check out some of our other videos consider subscribing if you haven't and thanks again we'll see you on the next one